<laughs> Cameraman, little D, Rourke, just said action. <laughs> so, hey, listen. As you know, many of you know, we're starting a band called Restore the Broken. I'm Tad Dameron. This is Danny Rourke. And our drummer, we think, his girl, his, his fiance, is probably having a baby. Uh, the baby's due today. And Danny, wouldn't you like to say happy birthday to somebody? Yeah, tonight, Jenny, Jenny, happy birthday, darling. You know, I love you very much. And I love you more now than I ever have. And uh, you put, talk, people probably ask him why. Well, I want to tell you, when, when the Lord comes into your heart, your eyes are wide open, buddy. Better than anything you've ever ever known or never wanted to know. It makes you love your loved ones even more. So, I love you, Jenny, and happy birthday. I won't say how old you are, because you still look like you're 20. I'll tell you what we should do. What's happy that? birthday. Oh, great. Thank you, Eddie. Let's do it. This happy birthday, birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Jenny. Happy birthday to you. What'd you say, little day? I don't think they know who Jenny and is. And I love you. That's my oh, wife. Really? My wife's Jenny Rourke. That's Jenny. Listen, I'm going you again. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Our drummer, I think, is having not, a baby. Not me. <laughs> not me. Not Briar. Briar's going to be our drummer, but our drummer Adam, I think, is probably involved having a baby. But there's a lot of people reaching out to us for prayer. There's a lot of people out there reaching out to us for more music. And we love your comments, and it's so encouraging. And so let me tell you, we decided, we've been busy. I've been down with my mom staying a few nights. I've been cleaning down there, and Danny's been busy. And, and, and the world, life, you know, gives us so many things to do. But I do want to tell you something before I get started. Uh, Vanessa Dameron, my cousin. Hey, Vanessa, I love you. God bless you. And Uncle Ernie and Aunt B, I didn't have time to learn that song, but I am going to sing that song without music. Uh, today for you, dear. But I want to tell you guys something. I was down at my mom and dad's cleaning yesterday. And I was wiping down walls. And man, there's a stairway that goes up to what used to be the attic and they've made it a bedroom over time. You see, as time and life progresses, as time and life grows on, you start adding and you start making way and you start making arrangements and you start doing things that need to be done in the home. And so our home went from a four-room home to a humongous, to me, a, a humongous home. But let me tell you something. There was a small little sign that says, worry ends where faith in God begins. And I want to repeat that to you right now. If you're worried about life and trouble and bills and girlfriends and boyfriends and husbands and wives and jobs, faith, I promise you with all my heart, faith in God will take away that worry. I promise you it will. I was washing the stairway and I was looking at those mattress boards and I know and realize that my mom and dad polyurethane stained those, and I guarantee you they prayed probably every stroke they took of a brush. And I was, I was, I was singing, and I was singing to the Lord, and I was just kind of in my zone, and I was praying for my mom. And today makes a month since my dad has passed, and I was just thinking about where he ends, where faith in God begins. My dad's not worried anymore. My dad's not in pain anymore. He's waiting on the Lord. He's actually in the bosom of Abraham. His appointment was made 40 years ago, I think. But man, each one of them boards, each one of them prayers, I, I, I claim the, the, the step up that we built an addition onto. I've seen people saved, born again right there at that step up. I've seen people give their heart to Jesus Christ in my mom and dad's home. We used to have church in my home. We used to have prayer meeting. We used to have singing. We used to gather up and sleigh ride. We had all kinds of things that the world's got too fast and too busy to do today. But Vanessa, listen, I was singing this song in there and, and I haven't had time to, uh, to learn quite the music. But man, I had a wash rag and I was singing some are known by great authority for kingdoms as far as eyes can see. In royal robes they rule from thrones, waging wars they overcome the weak. In 
and call it victory. Listen to this. My king is known by mercy. Thank you, Lord. My king is known by grace. For the hope in his name and the power that saves. Oh, my king is known by the cross. And my king is known by an empty grave. Oh, in all that he does. My king is known by love. Vanessa, God bless you. I'm going to sing a little bit of this again. I want you to get this in your spirit, and then we'll go to prayer, Danny, if you want to. I'm going to sing this again, if I can find it. Some are known by great authority, for kingdoms as far as eyes can see. In royal robes they rule from thrones, Waging wars, they overthrow the weak and call it victory. My king is known by mercy. And my king is known by grace. For the hope in his name and the power that saves. Oh, my king is known by the cross. My king is known by an empty grave, oh, in all that he does. My king is known by love. I love that song. I'm going to learn that song. I'm hoping people are getting on here. That's great. Listen, I want you to know something. This ain't for show. This ain't about show. God is putting together to restore the broken and I pray that we're going to be able to bless people and uplift people and speak in churches and spread the gospel on the street. Me and Danny both are sleeved out. God judges the heart. Man looks on the outward appearance. God judges the heart. We're born again, thank God, and we want to allow you the opportunity to be born again. We want to encourage you to seek God while he still can be found. But a lot of people have been wanting some music We've been super busy, but here we are tonight. Going to do just a little bit of music so you get to see us practice. None of this is going to be perfect. We're not perfect. But the Bible says if we look uplift Jesus Christ, it'll draw all men unto him, you see. And I believe that the most important thing we can do is accept Jesus Christ. Danny, if you will, buddy, would you like to take I us to prayer? I'd love to. And I'd like to say this too. I know we've been talking instead of playing music, but... I'm going to tell you, he was talking about how God loves your heart. I'm going to tell you guys, I'm still what, over a month in to get the, the Holy Ghost coming into my soul, into my heart, and, my, and I've, got, I've still got them, guys. And I'm going to tell you, tattoos, anything, it's just it's, it, God loves you for who you are, and he is absolutely as real as it comes. I'm going to tell you, he's real. And, and all you have to do is just have a relationship with him, guys. That's all it takes. And uh, you'll, get to, you'll, you'll get to see heaven. You'll get, you'll get to go to heaven. And it's 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 because there is a hell, guys. If there's a God, there's a hell. And it's scary to say, but I didn't believe it, and I believe it now. So, like I said, he'll save your soul if you just give your whole heart to him, guys. But I, I'm going to pray. Go, go hey, pray. First time I've ever really prayed in, just on, the, in, on camera, so just bear with me. Lord God Almighty, thank you so much for another day on this earth with my friends and my family. There's so many out there that needs prayer. And Lord, like Tad said, this is all for you. This isn't for show. This is all about you. And God, I know that you're going to bring together this group of people and you're going to put people in place where they need to be. Lord, if anybody's out there watching, you know, Lord, that you you can you can make them see this, and you can dag on it. You've got all the money and, and all the all the power to dag on have them to come come to you and give their life to you, Lord. I'd like to pray for a lot of people. There's a lot of people out there, and uh, I'd like to pray for my family and this family. And uh, we've got uh, my boss, uh, the the main guy. At my job is. He's pretty bad off, and Lord, please watch over his family and him, Lord. And it's not good, and you know that you can heal. And Lord, please look over Ad and his wife and their child, and Lord, because I know that it's going to change their life for the better. And he's got another little boy that it's just amazing how, 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 how children just change your life, Lord. And Lord, please be with us, and please touch anybody's heart and soul that's out there tonight. And Lord, thank you so much. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Amen. Amen.
Amen, buddy. What do you want to do? What do you want Man, to do? What, whatever you want to do. You want to try to struggle or you want to do one of these? Uh, uh, we've got a couple of ideas. Let's do let's do this one we've sung a few times to the table. Okay. And that's the way we get rid of the jitter. Okay. Right I tell you, the beauty of a great band, and we had a great band here the other day, and I think God's put together a great band. Is uh, it hides uh, some mistakes, but you know what? If you're singing to the Lord, there ain't no mistakes. I've been in churches, guys, where people couldn't carry a tune in a bucket, and they sung with all their heart to Almighty God, and I felt the spirit of the Lord just as strong as if I listened to the best singer on earth. God judges the content of your heart. He doesn't judge your body position. He doesn't judge uh, a lot of things, but He judges the heart. And so, if you're singing to the Lord. <clears throat> Hear the voice of love that's calling There's a chair that waits for you And a friend who understands Everything you're going through Shadows of your shame There's a light of hope that shines Won't you come and take your place And bring it all to the table There's nothing he seen before
<clears throat> you can private message us or you can put on there. You know, the other day there was quite a few people seeing this thing. And you know, there's power in numbers. There's power in prayer. The Bible says if two or three are gathered together in, in his name, he'll be in the midst. So if, if us are here and you 26 are there, then, then of course there's two or three gathered together. So God bless you. But... <laughs> And if you think the devil don't fight you, you're bad. Yeah, wrong. exactly. We've yeah. seen these songs, man. We was blowing each other's socks off earlier. We was like, man, that sounds so bad. Yeah, well, like I said, <laughs> you know, some of that high stuff we didn't do. It. And uh, uh, we've uh, been singing a lot lately. Yeah. Yeah, this cold weather don't do too good for your rough voices, too. Did I say about we're going to go down to Russell Prince's church? I, uh, I don't think you did in a life. What's, said, what's the name of that? <clears throat> um... Pie Pen uh, Pentecostal it's, it's House. Pentecostal House of Prayer. Hey, look, Russell Prince down in Pie, West Virginia, close to Varney, across Horse Pen, down through there. I've hauled coal down there. I'm sure I'm going to be able to find it. Pastor Russell Prince uh, down at the Pentecostal House of Prayer has invited us to sing, man. And we told him we was just getting a group together. And you know what? He said, man, you you guys just come down. We got drums. We got bass. We got guys that can play anything you can play. So, you know, we believe that God's putting together something here. But, Russell, God bless you. We'll be glad to come down there if it's just me and Danny. And, and, and you guys can uh, uh, fill in. But uh, we are absolutely trying to seek the Lord in all that we do here. But uh, I'll tell you, how about the struggle? Oh, okay. So which one you want to do? do? That sounds good. I love this one. What you, you do? That's fine. This Let's do it. We're going to do uh, all my tears. All I mean, my we'll tears. do whichever one. I, this song's amazing. Let me find it, buddy. Yeah. Here we go. Since you got your guitar, you yeah, have it because it's all right. Yeah. I, I, I forget know, the lady's right. name. There's a lady that says, hey, she wants more music, and I told her. Julie. I'm oh, sorry. Uh, I, I wish I could remember her name, but uh, God bless you, folks. Listen. Quite honestly, man, we're just trying to do. The Bible says, the Bible says in Ecclesiastes to do whatever you find. To Fill do. us. Huh? Fill us. Fill us. What about that? Thank you, buddy. That's the name of one of them. Oh, okay. The, the Bible says whatever the hand finds to do, do it with all your might. And so that's what we're just trying to do, guys. But Sad. let's work on this. Sad. Everything good? What you got going on, buddy? Uh, some, Did some, we lose it? no, we didn't lose it. Someone, oh, some, uh, there's somebody's writing into you. That's fine. No, 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 no. So, someone's trying to come up on the thing and be on the phone okay. on camera. Here we go. When I go, don't cry for me in my father's arms. I Sun and moon will be replaced with the light of Jesus' face. And I will not be ashamed, for my Savior knows my name. And it don't matter.
So weep not for me, my friend, when my time below was in. For my life belongs to him who will raise the dead again. And it don't matter. It don't matter where I lay. All my tears be washed away. And it don't matter where I lay. All my tears be washed away. Yeah, Jenny, Jenny kept telling us, you gotta see hey, this. Y'all gotta learn this. Real quick, I think someone wants to say something. I don't know. Like on the audio or something. Uh, we can't let them do that. I don't think. Listen, we're not technology savvy yeah. here, so. We're, we're just learning technology. <laughs> we can barely get this thing on listen, the video. Listen, somebody could come in there and say, you guys stink. Yeah, yeah, well, no, yeah. this guy right here, he said that he said great singing. Right? Thank you, buddy. <laughs> well, thank, thank you, you buddy. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, Sorry, our cameraman's my son, and the, <laughs> our, his son's our drummer. Uh, uh, and they're man. awesome. <laughs> well, <laughs> listen, I love it. be sure to be in that mic. Okay. I dare you know what I'll do? I'll just I'll just I like to play guitar, but I'm not good at it. And I guess I hide behind it before anything. Tad's always saying, if you will sing instead of trying to concentrate, and I understand why. Because man, when he sings, when he doesn't play the piano, it just man it's two totally different it's just two different sounds. Because I can't play the piano. Yes, you can. Too. You <laughs> so, can I think you can. Hey, y'all be pray, man, because I, I, listen, pray that the Lord sends laborers, you know, <laughs> uh, into the fields yeah, here yeah. for the harvest. Oh, so. And more singers, too, because I'm telling you, I want to learn to play guitar. <laughs> oh, I, you know what? I was going to take off with only like, you better put that guitar on. I just tell you where we're at. I don't know. So it's very rare that I get so to a good rap. singing. Hey, thank you. God bless you, buddy. Really it's our God's you. glory. I'm going to tell you, it really is, man. And uh, please really in that mark. I'll get in it. Is it yeah. I get too deep. People are like, man, it's too loud. Uh, okay. All right. But listen, sing it with all, with all your heart. heart. That's like uh, sing it with, with all your heart. Don't and if I mess up, it doesn't matter. Because, like I said, if I miss Lord's here. Lord's, Lord's here with us. You know what? Let me say something about that. We want, we don't, somebody the other day was wanting a buttoned up product. They wanted us all, uh, in my opinion, kind of like cookie cutter and everything squared away, this and that. Life ain't like that, you know. And I want you guys to see where we start out and where God takes us to. I want you to see these little sessions in our living room. I'm hoping that 100 people's in this house and 50 of them's drunks and rogues and thieves and whatever else. Because you know what? Jesus says, love God with all your heart, soul, mind, and strength. Love your neighbor as yourself. And he says, on, on these two things, hang all the law and the prophets. Well, you know what? We've quit loving like we're supposed to. We've quit being the hands and the feet like we're supposed to. And so I don't want a buttoned up product. One of these days we'll be great. One of these days we'll be rehearsed maybe. And we'll have every ooh, ooh, and ah, ah, exactly where it's supposed to be. Yeah. And God saved me, guys, because like I said, if you only know me a month ago, God saved me, drunk, rogue, and a mean person. I'm not kidding you. I mean, a lot of people probably didn't know that about me because I always put on a fake smile and made everybody happy. But I'm going to tell you, if God can save me, he can save you. And you out there saying, oh, now God, God don't love me. I was that guy. I can't get what you got, Dad. I can't get what you got, Christian people. But I'm going to tell you, if God can save me, he can save anybody. And I'm going to tell you, I'm so glad that you're watching. And like I said, I'm a changed man. I, I, my eyes are so wide open with life. And I'm going to tell you, once you got the Lord in your heart and your soul, 
it's a whole new different life, man. I wish you, I wish you guys could, I, I wish you guys could feel what I feel. I'd love to grab you all and just, oh, but I know it don't work that way, so, but it does through God. It, got, it does through Jesus Christ. And guys, I'm telling you, oh, I, this is the greatest thing that's ever happened to me and my family, my sons. It's sit back here. My son went and come out of his room. My son would never hug me. And my son is part of this with Tad Dameron. And thank God for the Dameron family. I'm going to tell you, I mean, even all the people that prayed for me, there's so many out there, and I know who you guys are. And I'm going to tell you, I love y'all. And I love, and I, I, I know I prayed for some people, but there's so many people. And my friends, because are going, and family, going through a lot of stuff with hospitals. And I can't mention names. But y'all know who's out there. And Lord, please watch over them. Please, Lord. You know, I, there's a healing hand in your hands, God. And please watch over them and keep them safe. And please give the family some kind of just some ease, you know, because it's scary when hospitals tell you things and it worries you to death. And the more you worry, the sicker I think you get. So Lord, like I said, please watch over them. And in Jesus' name, amen. I, I just went in a prayer. I can't help it. That's fine. Yeah, but there's so many I want to pray for. And you, and you just, you, you know, there's so many that you get. When you, Amen. Yeah, right. Yeah. Listen, yeah. Hey, look, I keep telling you, man, you have an opportunity to be 10 feet tall yeah. and walk through. Yeah. I tell you all the time, yeah. don't let, listen, you get a relationship with Jesus Christ, you let God guide you. Yes, you, yes. you can ask for people's opinions, but if yeah. it don't, if it don't uh, yeah. uh, coincide exactly. with what the Lord has put in your heart, then you just cut it off. Man. And that's what so, he's saying too, guys. And you, you got to. And if you do what he's saying and what God wants you, hey, he rewards you so much. You just won't believe how he makes your life so much better. The Lord says. It's the truth, guys. I'm telling you. I wish I wish y'all knew me before this. Then y'all would be like, wow. They're, they're, I'm going to tell you. But I love all of you guys, and you're supposed to, and I don't even know half of you. Vicky's, I love you. Vicky's in here, too. Hey, Vicky, my, my Aunt Vicky's. I love you, Vicky. God bless you, Vicky. Vicky, my Aunt Vicky, Vicky. Vicky. I want to tell you, my Aunt Vicky. You keep the prayers. Yes. You keep the prayers. You keep us back to the prayer. Yes. Listen, man. We're going to try to do a song. Okay. I can talk about no, no. that. <laughs> I just want you to sing this because I, I okay. love hearing you sing.
got high. It got so high there, man. I got woo! <laughs> 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 Get down back. Listen. Uh, here, here. I'll tell you what. I'm gonna let you. <laughs> I'm gonna let you remain yourself. Hey, that's okay because listen, you know, we that, that we don't we ain't worked on that last part. The chords was wrong on the shit gears. Yeah. And, and I need to go. But anyway, listen, hit that second verse. Second right? verse. No, wait a minute, that's uh uh, she struggles with a bitch. Okay. Hold on. <laughs> Let me get this out of my way. Man, listen. You know, the bad thing is, some people are praying and some people want us to fail. Uh, and yeah. <laughs> and listen, I love failing because I get to redeem myself. Wow. <laughs> She takes too much medications to cover up her tears. One pill will make her happy, two maybe make her sad. Then she notices a vibe in a hotel by her bed. She says, I am weary, I am worn. And I can't take it. My love has been my only friend So here I am, my heart to you I give well, Father, can you wash away these sins? Well, how the sun came out and the new day it was born I messed it up And all the pain they knew And the 